anite babes you know na madem sonje vile mko na feelings alafu ni mtu pia some at some point pia na ni crush ya let her because mm mimi nimekaa na yeye nimekuwa na yeye ni mtu mwenye tumekaa na yeye hivi ni mtu mwenye ninajua venye yako i know her feelings i know how she she's disciplined so she's pretty yeah she has got everything i deserve that unataka kusimama mca Hebu tell us about wow, that. Wow, thank you. Thank you so much. Kwanza na faunite Muhesh. Mheshimiwa, tuko na Muhesh hapa. So, persona. Hey, what's up good people of Fedi Media? Karibuni sana. Today we have Babushka. Tutakuwa tupiga story na yeye tujue amekwaje. Babushka, how are you? I'm fine. Mm -hmm. How about you? I'm good. Pleasure to be here with you. Mhm. Mm -hmm. mm. Imefurahia sana that hata umenipea tu hii chance. Manze shukran mm -hmm. karibu nimeona inadhani kwenye image wewe mtu pia unatafuta na pia mimi natafuta really? so through this maybe naweza pata kazi mm -hmm. or even pia wewe unaweza pata job really? so i'm um, humble to be here today mm -hmm. in your tv or even maybe media. channel or even media mm -hmm. so just feel free let's vibe let's talk mm -hmm. let's chat Mhm. Mm Sasa venye unakaa hivi vizuri, hebu tuambie hela ngapi hizi? Nini hiyo? Jacket. Atuambie tu hadi wote. Okay. Nimeva random lane za sema nimeva kama 15k. Mm -hmm. 15k 10k mm -hmm. around there. Mm -hmm. Ini 2500. Ini 2500. Mm -hmm. Ini 1500. Mm -hmm. Ini 2500. Mm -hmm. Kumbuka hii pia ni 1500. Kumbuka pia raw ni safi. <laughs> so viatu bado ni slide na ni origin na ni Gucci. Uh -huh. So mimi personally nimevaa mara tatu yako. Tunajua wow. hiyo hiyo umesonga na tuso. Hiyo <laughs> ni koshua. Umekuja kunipi. Hiyo ni koshua. Hiyo ni koshua. Ju hiyo hiyo ni tuso. Hizo ni ni braid. Zamani zinaitwa aje? Eh hii ziko hii niliona pale gikomba. Hii ni one twan. <laughs> Na zangu najua ni orange. Okay, kwa mtandao kuna hii ruma sana imetokea ya kufake. Hebu tell us about that. Where are you faking it? Mbona nasema ni mefake hii hii ice words. Hii ni ice words, hii ni orange, si ya fake wa dau. Eh, mimi nasema faking eh faking like faking eh mtu mwenye amleta faking ni watch ni true to watch dog. Watu unajua watu watu walikuwa na believe manze kitu tuna do basi hiyo watu wa believe tuna do je wanasema ah hii ni fake Aha unaona Asa umse umse ile kama jaribu ku kujaribu kuweka watu down like anjaribu kuchanganya you ta kili ati tuna fake kumbe atu fake ni ile watu wanaangalia life yetu ni expensive kuliko yenye wanai wanaishi so wanaona like si normal huyu mse ana fake so through to watch dog yeye ameona ni kama hii life manze iko juu sana kuliko yake so anajaribu kuonyesha wase wasi believe in us tuna do do us we posting this thing to motivate people when you wanna to view when you wanna to watch wana kumbe manze like through this person manze alianza chini sasa yeye anafanya hivi na mimi nasema like hii si ku fake wao ndo wanaona ni ku fake na si wao ni huyo msee ndo ameanza hii trend ya ati watu wana fake na yeye unajua yeye yeye unajua yeye ajaambiwa na fake juu life anaishi manzee ni kama wale wengine. Yake kwa life ya juu pia angekuwa anaambiwa na fake ange, angesikia aje. Imagine manzee huna jaribu ku make your life ikaifiti. Mtu anakuambia una fake. Unajua akisema una fake, unajua sharibu mentality ya wale wengine pia. Wale wengine wata believe that yeye huyu mse ana fake, but that's not the the reality. Kitu hiko ni huyu mse ana make pesa kuliko wewe mwenye unasema ana fake. So Manze watu wa fake watu wanaishi life yao na acheni watu waishi life yao kila mse yako na freedom ya kufanya kitu anataka kufanya ukipenda sasa hii useme viatu umenunua lakini ni zako no one will come and arrest you of saying so so you through to watch dog manze ni kama ni ni, ni, ni content like imemuishia so anjaribu ku, kufuatilia wase unaona anjaribu tu kufuatilia life ya mse of which hakuna kitu mbaya kama hiyo na ye unajua ina fuatilia life ya mse kama wewe ni DCI like or even it's a criminal case but with that that's not a criminal case ni mtu tu ameamua kuishi tu life anapenda na wewe unasema it ana fake okay so, of course definitely mimi ukifanya such kind of thing kuna wenye wana fake ungewaambia 
au wenye wana fake mimi nawaambia endelea ku fake manze juu una fake kitu wenye unatamani ukue ama ukue nayo ama uishi so wewe fake juu unatamani ukae hivyo wewe mwenyewe unajua una fake si ndio wewe mwenyewe unafanya kitu unajua yenyewe manzi kitu ni na fake so kitu una fake kitu una, kitu una post like una unataka kufanya au even like ni kitu wenye uko nao ama like si yako just fight for it wanasema nga fake until you make it so people faking like it's normal let's people fake until they make it na kama pia una feel unaweza fake go fake hakuna mtu mwenye amekuzuia ku fake so long as it's your life so long as uza kujua ni mbabushke nipatie pesa ni fake we fake to vile una feel penda no no jua ukipenda unaweza enda any place you fake but what i know faking is expensive like uki afford ku fake jua we ni mrich yeah Okay kuna e story that unataka kusimama MCA. Hebu tell us about wow, that. Wow, thank you. Thank you so much. Kwanza una faunite Mhesh. Mheshimiwa, tuko na Mhesh hapa. So personally uh, I can say um like uh, I have that passion like of uh, being a, a leader in this generation or even in this country or nation, you know. So personally manze I'm um, person living with disability nile watu wajanaona but mnaweza niteki you know So I'm um, person living with disability I can call you like this Cameraman umezuba So uh, I'm person living with disability and uh, I'm proud of myself I'm proud of my family I'm proud of my parents I'm proud of everybody who is watching and who is supporting me also. So my aim I want to lead people with disability in this nation and I know that I know that my dream will will be possible because uh, manze people living with disability like wamesahaulika kabisa na this our current government. Like you know watu nyoka disability wanateseka huko nje. Personally manze mimi niko na experience you know kama singekuja hapa nianze kufanya at least kitu ninafanya saa hii unajua ningekuwa wapi ningekuwa kwa street nikiomba watu manze nisaidie 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 10 bob nisaidie 20 bob you know but sasa mimi ndo napeana sasa you know so me i can say manze people with disability are going through a lot of problems a lot of challenges in their lives kuna watu wenye disability wenye wako na that knowledge but hawajapata that opportunity ya kupewa job kuna mtu mwenye ana disability mwenye hata saa hii ajakula mwenye saa hii amenyeshewa mwenye saa hii bibi amepelekwa na maji you know and government inaangalia tu na inasema na imagine kuna our leaders but they are nothing they are doing like wamesahau tu wao wase so personally i'm having that passion of coming out uh, and advocate them like i want to advocate them like i want to fight for their rights you know since i'm a law student i know our rights so our rights should be respected and we are equal and our rights should be eh uh, nasema our rights should be yeah should be respected mimi nadhatumia hiyo term because we are human being too we need protection we need equality manze ukipia huu mtu job kumbuka pia mlemavu ukipatia huu mse ugali kumbuka pia mlemavu ukipatia huu mse kazi kumbuka pia mlemavu watu wengi sana wale mavu wanateseka walai si eti ni uongo now we have our rights watu wengi sana wanyako na ule mavu hawajaenda shule juu hawezi tembea hawana wheelchairs hawana school fees wameacha na wazazi you know so my aim i have got a foundation nataka nianzishe saa hii babushka foundation this is a foundation for people with disability i want to make them to show them love i want to support them so that's my aim yeah Okay juzi tuliona uliweza kupata gari mpya mm-hmm. na tunaona kuko na disability how do you manage it uh, as in how do i manage like driving yeah, yeah. oh personally I'm, uh, I'm, i'm i'm still training i'm in a driving school i'm training but uh, i'm having a personal driver so i'm having someone who is driving me wherever i want to go there's someone who is driving me yes how is the feeling though I uh, can say manze like eh hey, manze kuko na gari at this age 20 years old uko na gari una own gari mm-hmm. na wewe pia ni millionaire mm-hmm. unaona like you know manze will come to that <laughs> it's something it's something that it's it's motivating you know mm-hmm. and people like our kwa wana wana believe this yeah. like my maybe village members or even what to like personally but I mimi siku believe mm-hmm. do this something that uh, I can say God has been so grateful to me yeah and I'm humbled about this 
this is a very, very big achievement in my life. My parents are proud. I myself am proud. My fans are proud of me. You know, that's a very, very good feeling and it's a happy feeling, a joyful feeling. Mm, I'm so excited. You've talked about being a millionaire. Ebu tuambi umepata milioni yako kiuwa na miyaka ngapi? Mimi personally nimepata meter last month. Like, ime come through like uh, brands. Like, people have been really appreciating what I do. And I'm still making up like... I'm still uh, having a lot of brands. Like this man says it's because of my discipline, this because of my um, consistency, this because of my hard work, because my numbers are growing. I've got almost 1 million followers on TikTok. I'm having almost 300K followers on Instagram. And I'm working with very, very popular brands in Kenya right now. Yeah. So through that brands, at least I'm growing. Like. I'm not the one I was before. Yeah. Okay, kuna u dem ana Jita Kate. Are you and Kate dating? I uh, know, I'm not dating Kate Tuku. <laughs> <laughs> but it's only a picture of Pale Mukichu, Muki, Malavidabi. Abu tell us about your relationship. <laughs> when I Kate. Abu tell us about your relationship na Kate. Relationship yetu na Kate. Kate ni best yangu, mreal. Yaani ule mwenyewe nikimwambia Manzelek nimekwama hapa apa, ana show up so Kate is a good friend of mine na sasa unajua vile yeye ni mdem lazima Manzelek anite babes you know na madem tunje vile mko na feelings alafu ni mtupia some at some point pia na ni crush here so mimi na dasema we are best friends una crush here mimi eh sana so given a chance would you consider dating Kate Kate yeah sure oh wow Kate <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? I'm <laughs> Why not? I will let her because mm mimi nimekaa na yeye, nimekuwa na yeye, ni mtu mwenye tumekaa na yeye hivi. Ni mtu mwenye ninajua venye yako. I know her feelings. I know how she she's disciplined. So she's pretty. Yeah, she has got everything I deserve. Yeah. Kuna dem flani sai kutaja jina yake. Flani ulikuwa na date and then two months down the line tuna na heartbreak. Hebu tell us what happened. <laughs> oh, nothing happened, but uh, we, 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 we parted ways, mm -hmm. like, mainly nilipitia hii route, mm -hmm. ya kapitia hii route, after to me introduce each other. Mm -hmm. So, it was kind of a mistreatment kidogo, tukawana hii ya yezi work. Mm -hmm. Jupia mafanzi walikuwa shawana hii, walikuwa shawana hii, hii noma. Kidogo, a yezi. Mazei misi kwa naona iti haita weza, but nyo nileona hii kuweza. Mm -hmm. Mm, so to part ways kila mtu sahi ako shughuli zake unaweza advise mtu mtu wako kwa mapenzi nini ndio kwa mapenzi akuwa ready to for for heartbreak <laughs> ani hiyo kuwa tu ready because uh, personally kitu nimepitia i can say be ready to for for heartbreak kwa nimepitia nini na kuwa strong <laughs> eh <laughs> Umepitia nini tu pesa ndani? Eh. Manzee nimepitia, nimepitia, nimepitia makubwa, nimelengwa, nimekuwa kwa street. Nimelengwa mimi nimebedwe nimesnobiwa sana na madem. Personally nimesnobiwa sana before tani because of your condition. Yeah, because of my condition. Manzee, si unajua ukiwa in this condition kama una do auwezi. Ni kama uja make it in life auwezi. So kama unajua tu uko in this condition of mind. Na una kitu una do. Uko uko una risk. Una risk. Juu saa hii manzee madem wanataka do. Madem wanataka waone una make money. Madem watakupenda juu uko na do. So clear. Hey. Manzee. Lakini tukikaa hivi manzee useme ati zi. Like useme ati mimi watanipenda. Wallahi imagine how easy juu mimi najua juu for example kama mimi sema ningekuwa sijasoma asi mtu like mimi ni mtu mwenye sijasoma siko capable of siko stable financially siko famous alafu ni kwa class nikwambia manzee i'm in love with you na sina do takuwa ngumu kidogo unaona nikwambia sina do nakwambia manzee i want to like i love you na wewe mazoe na manzee umse tabidi manzee nimembeba nimpeleke kwa bed to doze tabidi manzee nimembeba ni mlete hii side ingine ni mpikie. Juu mse, unja mimi siyezi pika. Siyezi enda shambani. You know. Na unapatayo time, sinado tena. 
like inakuwa ni noma wezi date mtu kama huyo like jusa huyo mtu anakupatia mzigo no so mimi nasema manzee watu wenye mko na disability like kama mimi kindly like tia bidi tu juu with us we are at risk because no one will love you with this, with this generation of ours hakuna mapenzi yenye like inakuja tu ile kama ya zamani eti mtu anakupenda real you know but at least kuona kitu yenye mtu anaona huu msee ako capable of at least anaweza ni finance at least tukiwaana nikiwa na mtu hii atalipa do ya hosi atalipa do ya matumizi you know but kikaa tu hivyo no kuna disability mtu wangu kwa hii nchi tuko nayo manze like angalia tu kitu utafanya like at least inakupatia do show ability in your disability usikae tu hapo juu as like ili manze tupate to live a best life lazima tu tusome like hakuna option it's unless you go it's unless you go to school work hard upate job or even do something itakupatia pesa juu sasa hii nothing no nothing like uwezi pendwa sasa hii manze bila do mtu siwezi kupenda juu ni mhandisa nilikuja tu ni entertain watu but pia kuna kumbe watu wenye kumbe hawakuwe entertained instead wana wanaanza kuniambia like wanaanza kuni wish like mabaya unaona mtu anaambia ni kufe huko ni kwende huko mtu anaambia nina fake like nina na fake siko hivyo like like niko niko poa ni ile napiga magoti ni kidance you know so mimi na nasema keep on watching like my progress because utakuwa tu hapo ukihate but me what i know i'm making something una hate na mimi naweka kitu kwa kwa pesa una hate na uko na so kwa mshwari ama uko na fuliza ya tu so <laughs> unaona so waendelea tu ku hate mimi naendelea ku move on na mimi sasa unajua sasa mimi hata ndo nimeanza ndio vile wananiona tu nime nime nimesonga ndio sasa ninaanza sasa nataka sasa kufanya vitu zingine eh? zitawa zitawashangaza tu eh uni babushka bado umemaliza mwaka fanya hii mwenyewe Sijamaliza mwaka. Uh-huh. Mm. So mtu atakuwa anasema, "Uni babushka." Anafanya hiki kitu. You know. So mimi ni mtu mwenye niko niko multi talented. I can do a lot of things by myself because I'm a very very popular brand. I'm a big brand right now. So to my haters, keep on watching my progress. I'll make you wonder. I'll shock you. So I'm just getting started. Keep on watching uh, and keep on hating too. Yeah that's my that's this my start. Tutakupata wapi kwa social media? Social media Babushka Kenya ni moja tu worldwide Babushka Kenya. <laughs> If you go there and search Babushka Kenya, hata si Babushka, ukianika tu Babush, Babush itakuletea Babushka Kenya. So search me at Babushka Kenya, follow me on TikTok at Babushka Kenya, follow me on Instagram at Babushka Kenya, follow me, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel at Babushka Kenya. Yeah, and my aim is to get into 1 million followers uh, before this year ends on TikTok. Yeah, so guys, keep on showing me love. I appreciate uh, I, I appreciate for your endless support. Keep on showing me love. Keep on supporting your boy and I'll forever make you proud. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. Bless up. Guys, tumekuwa na babushka mwenyewe. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye bye.